Uh, we started up Breeding Charlies uh, about 1964 and the reason we did that was we had heard that Charlies were the best producers of weight for age. We started the shop in 1974 and uh, it was based on Charlie Cross beef and we thought if we got maybe two or three years out of it, uh, th that would be it. But here today in 2010, we're still working with it, and we can only suggest and, and uh, that it was the Charlie Cross breeding that helped to keep us the way we're going at the present time. when we opened the shop beef collapsed and we were actually selling sides of beef at that at that particular time uh, at, at uh, 23 pence a pound. Things improved about 1976 and we started producing our own beef from the Charlie Cross. Uh, we bought a pedigree bull and uh, we, we discovered that the myth was true that the Charlies could produce beef uh, like no other breed could. We buy all uh, all our beef, what we can't produce ourselves, so we buy all from local farmers. There's no imports of any description come into the shop. It's all based on uh, the production line that we have set up with the local farmers is all based on them buying Charlie Bulls. We give them a good price for a good quality product. Uh, we, can, we can get uh, top grades. A little bit of fat cover doesn't do any harm. Uh, if you have a beast that has a wee bit of cover, it gives it added flavour. Now our, our customers keep coming back and we can only say that we think it is because we use Charlie beef. They always say uh, that's Charlie beef you're selling and that has helped us over the years since 1974 as I say we have snowballed to we're still here in 2010. We're a farm shop out in the country, people have to have to come to us, they can buy cheaper beef maybe out of the supermarkets but it is not the quality that the Charlie produces. As if the customer keeps coming back for more, isn't that really all that you need? Uh, we hang all our beef for uh, a minimum of 21 days. And uh, the charley, when you cut a sirloin and, and uh, put it into the pan, pan fried or grilled, it has a unique taste. It has a tenderness about it that people enjoy and they'll come back for more. We have uh, supplied... Uh, Barbecues up to maybe six or seven hundred people, and we never in all of those uh, times we never had a complaint about the Charlie beef. They would always have said the tenderness seems to excel. Charlie beef is unique in its tenderness, its texture, and its eating quality. Mm -hmm.